Hey guys, before we get started, I just want to congratulate Mobile Otaku HD for winning Common of the Week with I totally enjoyed teabagging you, smiley face. This was uh, as a result of our Twitch stream earlier this week. Uh, this comment really made me laugh because I teabagged him afterwards. Uh, so guys, enjoy the video. Thanks for watching. Hey guys, how's it going? I'm Wolf, and today I'm bringing you another, uh, yet another Android survival game. Uh, and in, in my opinion, this one so far takes the cake in terms of features, in terms of what, uh, like all the content and everything, and how far it's been developed so far. I had no idea this thing was on the radar until a viewer commented in my video, Drop Shots uh, 134, I'm thinking that was his uh, name. Uh, he said, hey man, love your channel, whatever. Check out this game. It's free, but it's an alpha, and it has multiplayer. Well, guys, uh, I have to say, uh, this game is very good. Except you have to set up your own graphics. Um, it has all the you can you can pick your own graphics for the game, uh, and it starts out really bad, but then you can level it up all the way to literally PC settings. Um, PC settings is extremely laggy. I'd be very careful with the PC level graphics. The extreme beautiful graphics, okay? I'd be very careful. You'd be extremely laggy and it'll literally cut out on you. So I have it basically set to medium settings and it runs very well right now. As you can see, the graphics, I mean, look at the the way that the, 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 the uh, just the axe looks. It looks very nice. But enough about the the X. What I want to do now is compare it to other Android survival games, mainly Rusty Survival. It runs on the same engine, but uh, this one was underneath the radar. I had no idea it existed until, obviously, the viewer commented and tell, told me about it. And now I know about it. It's phenomenally farther uh, developed, except for certain things like uh, uh, there's no day and night cycle. Uh, that might be in the extreme settings. I don't have that, but... Uh, uh, that's the only difference. That's the only thing that Rusty Survival takes the cake on uh, against this thing. Um, it has everything the same, basically, as Rusty Survival. You get one pistol, one rifle, uh, and an axe. Uh, but then also you can do other things in this game. Uh, there's multiplayer, as I mentioned. Uh, so far, what I know is that there's at least four people that could be in multiplayer on one map at a time. Um, and you can cut down trees. You'll see here uh, the tree will come down. I haven't made a little funny thing right here really quickly. Just watch, guys. Yeah. Yeah, it's that great. It's uh, mind-blowing. But so, yeah, see, the tree turns into logs just in the, just like in, uh, I think it's rust, just like in rust. And then you can pick it up. I'm not 100% sure how to put away my, my equipped items. So, uh, but in you with when you don't have an equipped item, you can actually pick up the log and then build an item. You can actually craft with it <laughs> and here I walked into the lake you're actually able to swim in the lake but I walked in and apparently there's two giant ferocious water cougars and then so yeah so I'm backing up as you can see also there's blood from injuries uh, just like in uh, uh, Daisy you can see the little you know blood dripping off of you stuff like that so that's nice they included that um, also they have animals and zombies. You can see the zombie walking up on the right side. How great timing is that, you know? Uh, tree chopping. Uh, later in the video, you'll see that uh, you can pick up a lighter. Uh, actually, we picked it up earlier in the hangar. Uh, uh, so you can pick up the lighter. And then you can... Actually, we pick it up later in the video. Well, you know, I'll, bring, I'll come back to that. Um, what else can you do in the game? Um, as you can see here, down in the right-hand corner... You can see a lay position and a crouch position. It's the first time I've ever seen a lay position in a mobile play, uh, platform. Um, I've never seen a lay position, not even in an FPS game. I've only seen crouch. Uh, and now you see we're... Look at the axe. Now there's blood on the axe because we killed a zombie with it. I mean, the, the thought process behind this game was very well thought. It was very well thought out. That's what I'm trying to say. It's very well thought out. And if you have this set to very high settings, I mean, there's grass. There's everything. And... That kind of computing power, I guarantee you, takes a computer, an actual computer. I don't have an actual computer. It's kind of disappointing, I know, but I can't do anything about that. 
Um, uh, shoot, what do I want to say? So as you can see here, you can open up your inventory, and that's up in the top left corner. Uh, there's something called inventory. And when you open that up, you can see every all of your supplies. Um, there's the axe, the pistol, um, uh, bandages, a syringe, uh, which helps with your help, which helps with your health, um, which is nice. Also, in the top right corner, you can see that there's a health bar. That's the red bar, and then the two blue, the the one blue and whitish bar is actually two bars. The top part of it is your endurance or energy and then the bottom part is your thirst and in the beginning of the video you saw me pick up pop cans and that is what you use to uh, quench your thirst and gain back energy uh, there's no food as of yet actually um, there's a steak if you kill a uh, cougar enough uh, you can if you kill enough cougars you can pick up a steak uh, but I have not done that in this one I I wasn't recording at the time here you can see we picked up some medicine. We'll go in here. We'll pick it up, and then there you go. Health. I was bleeding out too much. Um, I have to actually. There's more medicine, and there's a bandage. We need to pick up that bandage because I'm still bleeding, right? Um, so yeah. Now you'll see here pretty soon. We'll go back, and then I'll click on uh, the lighter that I have. Not just yet. Yeah, well, I was getting attacked. There's the AK. Um, you don't get a mag with the AK when you pick it up. That's a problem. Uh, you have to find the mag. I did not find the mag. I Apparently, you're only allowed to play through one day so far because it's an alpha game. You only get one day to survive, and then after you survive that game, it sends you straight back. Okay, here we go. Here's the letter. But after that one day, it sends you straight back to the home, uh, the main menu, and then you can't do anything. So as you can see, my health bar went down. I don't know what happens here, and then I got sent to a different place. I don't know why. Now I have more health. So as I move forward here, you'll see that a castle comes up in the distance. Uh, it might not come up just yet, but there is a, a stone, kind of ruins castle back there, um, which I will eventually get to. Now what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to get my equipment away. I don't know how to put this my equipment out of my hands and so just have my two fists out again. But now, so what I do is I pick up the AK out of my inventory. But well, now what happens is you'll hear some clicking sounds in the background. That's me hitting the trigger button. But what happens is since I don't have any ammo, it's just the hammer keeps going down. So that's that's what that is. It's not the gun shooting. It's not what it's supposed to do. I just don't have any ammo in the weapon. So now we're moving up towards the castle here. I don't know why I'm moving so slow. Oh, I'm moving so slowly because I don't have any energy. So I drink. Uh, I get a drink. And then you see my energy bar moving up. And then I'll be sprinting here. Or I don't know if I sprint. I don't remember. But I'll get up there eventually. You can aim down your sights with your weapons. You can switch your weapons. You can reload your weapons. Uh, right now, I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, just moving the weapon back and forth. Oh, there you go. Re re reload. And now, I'm, since I'm at the ruins now, what happens? They survived. That's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed my video. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your day. Comment, rate, subscribe. I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching.